Hey Prismatic family, Chad here. Today we are at a beautiful property in Yorkville, Illinois, one of our longtime commercial clients, the y -Pack. Join us as our crews get cutting and taking care of this place and getting it in tip-top shape for this season. Just a quick little update. Just finished up getting some content, checking in with the guys here at YPAC. They're doing a fantastic job. Now me and Chris are on our way actually to Target Decorated Apparel, and we're going to pick up our new uniforms for the season. So I'm stoked to see you for the first time. Let's see it. So, all right, we'll catch you up when we're there. Just wanted to give a little update. We've just made it on over to Target Decorated Apparel, and we're about to go inside and see the first finished products of this season's crew attire for both our site crew and our office admin. Let's go on in and check it out. So we have just arrived and we're fortunate enough to let them let us back in here to give a quick look. So if you can see here, that's where they do all of their printing and all the work for the company. Right here, right here. Oh. We're just we're from Prismatic Site Management. Uh, we're here with the management team where we just had our clothes for the season actually and we're doing a little partnership with some people. Yeah, cool. I was just wondering who you guys were. Oh yeah, you can find us on YouTube uh, for Max Live Management. Okay. Mike's gonna be like, you guys still coming? This should be a skag advertisement. Buy yourself a skag. They'll get stuck in the drainage ditch.
Chad here, CEO of Prismatic Site Management. We're on site today at a beautiful property out here in Oswego, just getting a little bit of cleanup done here. We have quite a few projects here. One, we're going through, we're getting rid of all the debris on the property. Two, we got James in the back cleaning up all the dead trim off all the trees back there. And then lastly, we're just gonna come through here, make sure it looks clean, and then this week, later this week, we'll actually come back and mow.